in our previous video we were discussing europe countries and their capital and coastal region but uh, on that video we have mistaken something so firstly we will see that then we will go further so first of all here one gulf you can see gulf of toronto and <coughs> between adriatic sea and Ionian sea you can see a strait of otranto that means you can say a strait of otranto join Ionian sea and adriatic sea while isolate italy from the <coughs> these country which which are situated in other coastal region in front of italy second thing i have mistaken here as i discuss sea of marmara is situated but between sea of marmara and aegean sea one thin strait is situated which is called as strait of dardanelles strait of dardanelles dardanelles so these are two things third things is <clears throat> i have discussed portugal is westernly country of europe but it's not iceland is westernly country of europe because from here approx 26 27 uh, <coughs> longitude <coughs> is passed from here approx 26 27 longitude is passing from here but from west part of portugal approx 10 12 um, uh, degree longitude is passing from here so that's why on the basis of passing latitude iceland is westernly country of europe now i will discuss one by one from north to south So first of all, you have to know <coughs> about Scandinavian countries or Nordic countries, also Scandinavian countries known as Nordic countries. So you have to know how much countries are situated under Scandinavian countries. So there are five countries under Scandin Scandinavian countries. First is Iceland. Second is Norway. Third is Sweden fourth is finland and fifth is denmark there are five countries situated under scandinavian countries <coughs> <coughs> rexavik as i discussed in earlier video <coughs> rexavik is capital of iceland and it is not merely ice uh, capital of iceland rather it's also northerly ca capital in this world <coughs> second norway second norway in norway there and there no any reserve of oil and coal norway countries uh, totally uh, be, uh, totally depends on <coughs> their hydroelectrical power plant and uh, per capita availability of hydropower plant <coughs> is highest within a world so third is sweden sweden is largest country of uh, scandinavian and stockholm i as i discuss stockholm is capital of sweden and also known as stockholm as an beauty of sea now again finland is country situated there finland country also known as land of forest and forests and lakes because numerous number of forests and lakes are situated there so that's why it's called land of forests and lake and helsinki is capital of finland and also it is situated in a coastal region of gulf of finland and <coughs> it it popularly known as white city of north so you have to remember all about it 
here Denmark is situated and Copenhagen Copenhagen is capital of Denmark which is popularly known as the key of Baltic Sea <coughs> now I will discuss physical landscape of Europe here you can see here one you can see one mountain is situated which is called as is can Davian mountain system here upper side of uh, Scandinavian mountain system one another mountain system is situated which is called as Kuzlan mountain Kuzlan mountain this peninsula is known as Kola peninsula Kola Peninsula. What is Kola? Kola uh, what is Peninsula and what is concept behind Peninsula? I have discussed in um, earlier my video, which were I, I would do, I was discussing North America. So if you don't know, you can go and watch there. So <coughs> and <coughs> in this reason. this is mountain this is another mountain and in this region one plane is situated which is called as also it is extended to these plains which is called as land plane <coughs> so these are <coughs> uh, uh, physical landscape of um, Scandinavian countries and uh, coastal region as I said I have discussed earlier in this video earlier in this uh, earlier that video so now I will discuss further from it here you can see Vestula river is flowing in Poland and Vestula river is most important river for Poland because of storage of coal and due to storage of coal here <coughs> um, numerous uh, industries are developed and <coughs> in Krakow Krakow is a city there uh, high, highest development of iron and steel in Poland so you have to know first of all Vestula is uh, originating from where here one mountain is situated which is known as Carpathian mountain Carpathian mountain and here another mountain is situated called as Tatra mountain Tatra mountain from Carpathian Vestula river is originating and from Tatra mountain other river is originating so here you can easily understand from here Vestula river is originating and entered into Poland and this basin of Vestula river is most important for coal reserve that's why numerous industries are developed here and firstly uh, textile industries are developed in Warsaw which is capital of Poland and Warsaw is also situated in shore line of Vestula river but due to other industries development textile industries shifted to loads here you can see Lord city is situated in Poland that's why Lord city called as Manchester of Poland basically Manchester is a uh, United Kingdom cities their highly development of textile industry so that's why on the basis of that footprint <coughs> Lord's called as Manchester of Poland so here you have to know him uh, here you have to know manchester uh, is about a textile industries now i will discuss the 
ओदर रिवर ओदर रिवर एज आई सेड ओदर रिवर ओरिजिनेटिंग फ्रॉम तात्रा माउंटेन सो तात्रा माउंटेन इज सेचुएटेड हियर एंड फ्रॉम हियर ओदर माउंटेन इज फ्लोइंग एंड इट्स ऑल्सो मेक पॉलिटिकल बाउंड्री बिटवीन पोलैंड एंड जर्मनी इट इज ऑल्सो एन अदर मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट रिवर ऑफ पोलैंड एंड इन एग्जाम क्वेश्चन कैन बी आस्क विच वन रिवर मेक्स पॉलिटिकल बाउंड्री बिटवीन पोलैंड एंड जर्मनी देन आंसर इज ओडर रिवर एंड आई विल डिस्कस फर्दर वेस्ट ऑफ पोलैंड देन in <coughs> germany east you can see elbe river is flowing here and berlin is situated in shore of tributary river of <coughs> elbe river elbe river basically originated from bohmer mountain system if he, it is elbe river to so elbe river is Uh, originating from one mountain which is called as bohmer mountain after originating from bohmer mountain it entered into germany and uh, it uh, it uh, it makes very important uh, um, eastern region of germany yes. <coughs> and <coughs> Hamburg basically situated on shore of um, uh, Elbe River, and Hamburg basically known for highly development of shipyard industries in Germany. So this is most important fact. But in uh, border between Denmark and Germany, you can see. Kiel Canal. Kiel Canal basically man-made canal which reduces distance between Baltic Sea and North Sea. I have discussed earlier about coastal region of uh, um, Europe. That's why I'm going fast in coastal region. <coughs> so here, as I said, here Kiel Canal is situated and. Uh, adjacent area of kiel canal is popularly used for uh, production of uh, dairy product and production of eggs and other agricultural products so that's why <coughs> this place is most important for exportation of dairy product and x type product now i will discuss here one another river which is called as weser river weser river weser river basically originated from as i uh, bro braver river uh, basically weser river basically originating from this mountain and this mountain called as black forest black forest that means here you can understand very easily if it is alps mountain it is rhine river if it is alps mountain it is rhine river here one mountain is situated here another mountain is situated and this mountain called as black forest black forest and from black forest weser river is originating weser river is originating so in this political image you can see from here weser river is originating and lies into north sea in shore of weser river bremen is situated and bremen is uh, basically most important city of germany uh, for paper industries now i will discuss uh, 
राइन रिवर विच इज मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट रिवर ऑफ जर्मनी बेसिकली यू हैव टू नो दिस इज इफ दिस इज अल्स माउंटेन हेयर ब्लैक माउंटेन इज सचुएटेड ब्लैक फॉरेस्ट इज सचुएटेड हेयर एंड अदर फॉरेस्ट इज सचुएटेड विच इज कॉल्ड एज वोसेज दिस वोसेज दिस इज ब्लैक फॉरेस्ट ब्लैक फॉरेस्ट if it is alps mount this is highest peak of alps mountain which is mount blank and from alps mountain rhine river is originating and here you can see if this is alps mountain and if this is black forest if this is versus mountain here rhine river is flowing and it is most important river of germany because this basin river is basically storage for coal reserve that's why due to reserve of coal uh, numerous industries have developed there <coughs> however one another fact you have to know uh, rhine river uh, flows into rift valley what is rift valley what is concept behind rift valley i have discussed when i ever when i was discussing uh, south america in magdalena river you can go and watch there if it is rift valley where uh rhine river uh, where uh, rhine river is flowing that means this mountain that means block black forest and versus versus mountain called as block mountain <coughs> as i said this is very important <coughs> river of germany <clears throat> that's why here highest here highest development of industries and it is busiest inland waterway of europe and in mouth of rhine river which is which lies on north sea rotterdam is situated and rotterdam is basically busiest seaport of europe in stuttgart in germany is uh, that automobile industries are highly developed there frankfurt frankfurt basically river port of uh, germany and it is busiest river port of europe also asen in asen <coughs> of germany there chemical industries development was highest in germany and <coughs> in north of rotterdam you can see amsterdam which is capital of netherland there it it is popularly famous for polishing and cutting high quality of diamond so these are fact about the rhine river which is most important river also you can see rhine river makes political boundary between switzerland and austria because here it is flowing and then makes political boundary between switzerland and germany then makes political boundary between germany and france then totally entered into germany then netherland and uh, <coughs> on coastal region of netherland it lies on north sea <coughs> here you can see another river another river as i discuss if it is alps mountain it is uh, black forest that means it is versus mountain which is situated in france from versus mountain one another river is originating <coughs> which is 
मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट रिवर ऑफ बेल्जियम विच रिवर कॉल्ड एज स्लैडल्ट स्लैडल्ट रिवर एंड ऑन माउथ ऑफ सेडल्ट रिवर एंटवर्प इज सेचुएटेड एंटवर्प इज सेचुएटेड एंटवर्प बेसिकली एंशियंट सिटी ऑफ यूरोप एंड इट वॉज पॉपुलरली नोन फॉर हाई क्वालिटी ऑफ कटिंग एंड पॉलिसिंग ऑफ डायमंड बिफोर अर ऑफ एमस्टरडम सो दैट्स वाई हेयर यू हैव टू नो मे बी इट पॉसिबल यू कैन नॉट फाइंड इन योर एटलस बट इन योर एटलस यू कैन मार्क हेयर हेयर एंड वॉप एंड वॉप इज सचुएटेड हेयर एंड वॉप इज सचुएटेड एंड वॉप इज सचुएटेड ऑन माउथ ऑफ सेडल ट्रीवर मे इट्स पॉसिबल यू कैन नॉट फाइंड एंड वॉप सिटी एंड दिस रिवर ऑल्सो सो दैट्स वाई यू यू कैन मार्क ऑन योर एटलस नाउ आई विल डिस्कस नाउ आई विल डिस्कस शाइन रिवर शाइन रिवर बेसिकली मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट रिवर ऑफ फ्रांस एंड शाइन रिवर बेसिन बेसिकली मोस्ट पॉपुलेटेड प्लेस ऑफ फ्रांस ऑल्सो हेयर वन माउंटेन इज सचुएटेड कॉल्ड एज एवेंजर Avenger mountain is situated, and from Avenger mountain, Sin River, Sin River is, and on shore of Sin River, Paris is situated, which is also a capital of France, and it is popularly famous for toiletries product and cosmetic product, and it is high populated city of France. So that's why you have to know. शेन रिवर बेसिकली लाइज ऑन इंग्लिश चैनल इट इज इंग्लिश चैनल आई हैव डिस्कस अर्लियर एंड इन दिस प्लेस ला हार्वे ला हार्वे इज सेचुएटेड एंड इट इज इंपॉर्टेंट सी पोर्ट ऑफ फ्रांस in east of english channel that means if it is english channel here you can see dagger bank dagger bank fisheries industries are highly developed here because of high production of fisheries sector so that's why here you have to know this रीजन ऑफ यूरोप दिस कोस्टल रीजन ऑफ यूरोप वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर फिशरी सेक्टर विच इज कॉल्ड एज डागर बैंक ऑल्सो वन बैंक आई हैव डिस्कस दैट वॉज ग्रैंड बैंक इन नॉर्थ अमेरिका विच वॉज कोस्टल रीजन विच वॉज सिचुएटेड इन कोस्टल रीजन ऑफ कनाडा इन न्यू फोनलैंड एंड वॉट 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 कॉन्सेप्ट बिहाइंड दैट वॉज आई हैव डिस्कस अर सो यू कैन गो एंड वॉच देयर now i will discuss loire river loire river basically originating from one river which is called as sinis mountain sinis mountain are <coughs> also called as sevenis mountain sevenis mountain from sevenis mountain loire river is originated and lies on bay of biscay near nantos and nantos basically most important city of france <coughs> for paper industries uh, what what is 
कॉन्सेप्ट बिहाइंड यूनाइटेड किंगडम वॉट इज कॉन्सेप्ट बिहाइंड आयरलैंड स्कॉटलैंड इंग्लैंड आई हैव डिस्कस्ड इन माई प्रीवियस वीडियो कोस्टल रीजन ऑफ यूनाइटेड किंगडम आई हैव डिस्कस इन माई प्रीवियस वीडियो एंड ऑल्सो आई हैव डिस्कस कॉन्सेप्ट बिहाइंड यूनाइटेड किंगडम स्कॉटलैंड ग्रेट ब्रिटेन नॉर्दर्न आइसलैंड आयरलैंड आई हैव डिस्कस वेरी मच इन माई अर्लियर वीडियो यू कैन गो एंड वॉच दैम here another <coughs> here another river is flowing in france which is called as garun 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 river basically also originated from sevenies sevenies also originated from sevenies Sevenies and in shore of <coughs> in shore line of Sevenies, you can see here. You can see here. This is Sevenies. You can see here. Toulouse city is situated, and another city is situated, which is called as Brodax. Toulouse city basically most important city for Fra uh, of France for. aeronautical industries because of clarity in weather and brodex is another important city of uh, um, france for uh, high quality of wine so that's why in this video this is too much i will discuss further in my next video